Okay, so now I'm going to show you part of where I went walking earlier this week. Uh, this is the other place, the first place I found uh, here on the apartment complex. Uh, now, obviously this is a drainage um, ditch or a culvert. Um, up there is the main road back into the apartment complex. I didn't start this at the top because, you know, those, those rocks are a little bit loose. And yeah, I didn't want to drop the camera. Hell, I, I slipped and uh, scraped my leg a little bit on my way back down. Uh, now the thing is, the reason I can walk down this, because I don't know how else is going to show up, but this is an actual creek bed. This isn't stony, that's actual sand in it. Uh, the thing is, North Carolina is currently under the worst drought conditions. It's been declared a uh, like the highest or most severe level of drought. And uh, under normal circumstances, this here has at least some water running throughout it. Whereas right now, you know, it's dry as a bone. It's muggy as hell out here, but we haven't actually had any rain. And so, you know, this creek bed turns into a path. Now, up here, this is the kind of shit which makes me at least somewhat of an environmentalist. I mean, this is a creek. This is at least it's supposed to be natural, and there's trash just lying all around. There's like a, a KFC cup, there's beer bottles, you know, just, just ditched everywhere. Hell, deeper in here, I saw a Jack in the Box cup or, or earlier. You know, one of those ginormous plastic ones that uh, you could fit a puppy in. Note, I do not advocate the consumption of puppies. And then this, this here is what I was talking about when I said it can get pitch black under here when it's bright and sunny outside. I mean, look at that, all that tree cover. Right there is frankly the clearest space above me right now. And you can see how little light you can actually get through there. So, I mean like, here look at this tree stump. It's dead and rotted. Oh. And this here just looks like a natural seat, doesn't it? Whereas, you know, most of the time all of these roots here are underwater, at least partially. It really is like stepping into a different world. It's just weird to me how this is literally, literally a three minute walk from my apartment. That you can get this wild and unfettered nature cheek to cheek with the trappings of civilization. The creek bed is getting more rocky now, more uh, small stones and tree litter. And the farther down we go, and you can see the, uh, the higher the creek beds are. North Carolina is actually hydrated. This sucker must be run. It must run pretty high. This log here is as far as I came before. I had other stuff I wanted to get done and, you know, needed to keep going. Let's take a look and see what we can find, shall we?